loaded up with the jam, some quail eggs and their fresh market veg, the canapes for tonight are sorted. Across town, the other three battle chefs have also been sniffing out the local produce. Right then, guys, we better uh, head to the restaurant. Is a Michelin no, no. star restaurant? Yeah. Marco was the youngest guy in the world ever to get a Michelin star. How old is he? Marco, he's about 102, 103. <laughs> he's been around for years. John, Keith and Sam are researching the starter. My feet hurt. Are you moaning again? Yeah. I know. Jesus. And Marco sent them to Michelin-starred restaurant Anapita. Hello. Hello. Simon. Yes, that's me. Hey! hey. Run by UK-born head chef Simon Andrews. You ready? Yeah. I think so. We'll do some fish. Red mullet and some langoustines as well. We're going to use the uh, fish heads and the langoustine heads, OK? OK. <gasps> okay. Ever so easy. Corsica is less than 60 miles from Italy, but it's been ruled by France since the 18th century. Its cuisine is a fantastic blend of both Italian and French. Yeah, we're going to make ravioli, which, okay. which is going to go with the red mullet. For each ravioli, we're going to use two langoustines. We're going to put the langoustine heads in hot oil, OK? We want these to get really, really caramelised, OK? This starter of langoustine ravioli is pretty complicated. It involves fresh pasta, handmade mousse and fresh fish. Sam, would you like to go to descaling the fish? Do you want to have a go? Can I wear black gloves, please? Of course you can. This is really vile. You're yeah, oh, doing yes. a good job. Now you've got to cut the head off. Behind the, the ear. Yeah. The ear? <laughs> Behind his ear. <laughs> oh, lovely. Fantastic, fantastic. <laughs> Sam's also under pressure. We're getting there. Hopefully, if this goes out, I want it to go. We should be all right. It may have appeared easy to make in the restaurant this morning, but without anyone to help, Sam's feeling the strain. 